Today, I'm gonna to show you how to add a progress animation to your Wave video. Progress animations show you a visual representation of the elapsed time of your video. Popular content creators like Gary V often use these sort of animations, especially in shorter clips. This allows viewers with shorter attention spans to know that watching your video won't take up too much of their time. And progress animations work especially great on Instagram videos. And that's because Instagram does not have any sort of progress bar for their video player. And on other platforms like Facebook or LinkedIn, adding a progress animation can be a very nice touch to go along with your podcast audio or musical track. So without further ado, let's visit wave.co and look at how easy it is to add one of these animations. First, we're gonna log in to our Wave dashboard. And if you don't yet have a Wave account, you can actually sign up for free and try it out. So to start off, you'll probably wanna start with a new design and you'll need to upload your podcast or album artwork. And later on is where you'll also upload your audio file. Be sure and check out some of our other videos to learn exactly how to do that. But for now, I'm actually going to go to my designs and start with one that I've already created before. So you'll see that I've previously added a waveform animation to this design, but I haven't yet added a progress animation. So let's go ahead and do that. Click up here and just look at all the different options that we have. So let's look at this here. So you can drag it anywhere and you can resize it as needed. Let's look at this one too. The thing I love about this one is that you can really um, resize this to make it a much larger. We could put it at the bottom and also make it much more subtle, make it really tiny like that. You also have this one here, it kind of looks like a pie chart. Again, you can resize. I think I'm gonna go with this one for this specific design. I'm gonna drag it down here and kind of put it around the Wave logo. And as needed, you can use your arrow keys to position it the way you need to, center it correctly. Now what I really love is that you can actually incorporate this within your branding. So I'm gonna do that by changing the color scheme of this specific design. We're gonna change the main color to white, and then I'm gonna make this the, the wave turquoise color. And that's it, it's pretty easy. Now we're just gonna click save, and it will allow you to actually preview your design right here. Next is where you upload your audio file. And when you're ready, you can click generate video and preview the video that you've just created. Let's take a listen. We all know that YouTube is the second largest search engine on the web and can be one of the best places to promote content. However, if you're an audio creator, you probably know that YouTube isn't really designed for handling audio content. Awesome, it looks pretty good to me. So next step is just to download it and share it on social media. And lastly, I wanna show you some other examples of what audio creators like you are doing to share Wave videos on social media. Check it out. So as you can see, Wave just makes it so easy for you to share your audio content on social media. If you haven't yet, be sure and visit wave.co and sign up today.